Oof, oof. Oh, Lord. Snowball. Ouchie, we're both dead. Pew, pew. I feel like Tom oh, Hanks no. treated a tank instead of Perfect Ryan. Actually, screw this. Oh, jeez. Well, I tried. I got so far. Rockets! And... Rockets! Rockets! It worked. Where are you? You're dying. I'm about to get up. There I, we go. I did it. You did it. Be proud. Everybody oh. gets a rocket. You got a rocket. You got a rocket. I feel perhaps we may be a bit under level. No. Yeah. But it's fine. I don't know what to do about it. We've done like all the quests except for like three. Yeah. They're just really rough. I don't remember this being this rough though. Me neither. I think it's because we're doing... Oh, you know what? We haven't even done contracts or anything. Contracts? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sign my life away to you in servitude. What are you talking about? Oh, that. Talking oh, about I respect, so I don't even have that anymore. Oh, okay. Well. That's why my, my frost pulls them in. Ah, okay. I know nothing about Aurelia other than that. I haven't tried her. I'm out of ammo! Owie, oh, owie! I don't know what's hitting me. <laughs> You're a bully. I'm gonna shoot with a rocket. Right. And a rocket. And a rocket. But I missed. So I shot again, but I missed. Keep firing. Ammo. Fired again, I missed. Oh. Holy frick. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna bust you, you stupid ghost. I know you killed it. Bust you. Oh god. Backflip into lava. You pusillanimous cantankerous. Where are you? Where are you? Where He's are invisible you? right next to you. You blocked oh, my I tried. shot. You blocked my oh. shot. You ruined me. You ruined me. Oh, I ruined you. Goodbye, friend. <laughs> oh, that's a terrible death animation. I had this stupid splits butt in the air, like flop over for no reason. <laughs> She's like, goodbye. I quit. Yep. Okay, where's this? Yeah, keep is hitting this? me. See what happens to you. I You're hope gonna this have is a bad the right time, my one. friend. I like this music though. Oh, I actually died. Well, that sucks. Well, I don't think this place resets. No, no, no. But, uh... That means I squandered your life for nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Story of my life. I squandered it. I squanched it. Squanto. Whoa. Freeze. Everybody chill. This pistol is not as good as I hoped it would be. Oh. Wow. I actually love that Batman and Robin movie, and I know it's <laughs> terrible. But God, Uma Thurman. Uma has poison Thurman. Ivy. Jeez. I think we talked about this before, because you mentioned that, and I said you should watch... The Adventures of Baron Munchausen for more oh, that's Uma right. Thurman action. I need to watch that. I love her. Oh. I, I remember watching The Producers because she was in it. I didn't know she was in The New Producers. I've only seen the old one. And it was wonderful. Matthew Broderick's in it. I like Matthew Broderick, but it's hard to compete with Gene Wilder and Zero Mostel. That's true. Gene Wilder's pretty good. Big Dominican chest. <laughs> and we got... Oh. Oh my. Oh, ah, uh, George Decay. The Diva Temp. I will try you out, Diva Temp. Oh! You know there's another chest. Another chest room, right? Which I went? The one I'm in? Yeah. I mean, what, other than the one I'm in right now? That's what you mean? Mm-hmm. Uh, I did not. I will take you there, my friend. I'll take you places. In a world of pure imagination. Frostbite and short summer are those skills that I have. Frost. Ooh, amp shot. Yes, please give me. I have no ranks in frostbite. Short summer, I have three ranks in. Oh. I should really respec into that. Yeah, I'll equip that. Is it this room? It is this room. Okay. The pod snappery. 
I am now at level 27, indifferent gentry. So what did you do? Did you go down the purple? No, you're still in here. Now we go, we go to this room. Let's see if I can remember how to get up here. Let me empty some of the stuff out of my inventory. <laughs> I may have been a little greedy. Oh, it's fine. Make some space. It is up here. Oh, there's more, there's more um, ammo and stuff. Cool. I think three out of my four weapons are Vladif now. They're fast. They're furious. That's how Vladoff operates. Okay, so we gotta get up here. And then... Up there? How did you do that? So, I just jumped. Hey, hey. Yeah. Hey, hey. Gotta get up here. Oh, God. Up here. Which is also a vault symbol here, if you care about that. Aha. Uh -huh. Slightly. I don't actually expect to get them all. Then you get up oh, here. Oh my gosh. It's just like real Mario. Yeah, so many treasures. Oh, we go. And we <laughs> walk past the first treasure room to another one in the back. That's freaking awesome. Yay! There you go. Acid farts. What do we got in this chest? We got a poiple shield. Ooh, not uh, bad. Not it's as good as not as good as my one. Yeah, it's not, as, yeah. <laughs> it's not bad, but it's not as good. I, I, I just got an amp shield, so I'm like, yeah, I'll keep that. Mm, nice. And I think it's the middle pipe that you can go down. Yep, and it pops you back out. I will take purple shield to sell for money at market. Do. You must do. What is this? A blue rocket launcher? Is it better than my cool one I currently have? It is. I don't Ooh. want it to be. I like the one I currently have so much. Yeah, because it's like speedy. So it's yeah. like, yeah. Geronimo. Ah, poof. It's a fast Geronimo. Yeah, it just spits you out. What's right, the damage from Paris between the rocket launchers? It's an extra thousand damage. It's like a 50% more damage rocket launcher. Ooh. Holy jeez. And electrocute damage is good. But smaller magazine size. We'll use it for now. We'll see. We'll, we'll get a test run. How do we get across here? We just jump from iceberg to iceberg? Can we even? Oh, we have to. Or do we? Tell my wife I love- oh. Oh no, that's just instantaneous I didn't death. even touch the ground. I just watched Jeez. you die too. I was like, well. I'm a gone. guinea pig. Oh my guinea pig. I had I gave him a bunch of snap peas. And I gave one oh. into his face and he took it and he ate it. And I put the rest in his food bowl. And so I'm sitting on the couch eating my lunch. And he finishes the first one. And he comes over and he's like begging. He's like, that was so small, master. I need more treats. And so I get up. And I just put my finger in his bowl. And so he walks over and he's sniffing my hand. And he's like, oh, there's more food in my bowl. And so then for the rest of the day, he's just like running out of his house, grabbing a single pea, running back into his house and crunching it. And then running back out over and over until they're all gone. Aww. It's like, there's a better way to do that, you dummy. Yeah, but it's cute. It's, it's entertaining. super cute. Yes. Aww. I love guinea pig. I've never had one, <laughs> but I know if I had one, I would love it. His name is Buster. Pig. That is a that is an appropriate name for a guinea pig. I named him that after Buster Friendly in Blade Runner. Ah, uh, my parents had a cat named Buster. He knew how to open doors. Oh dear! Don't jump on me, bro. I'll snipe you. No scope. It's easy to no, no scope, scope when you have a machine gun for a sniper rifle. Yeah, just kind of. Pull the trigger and yep. just aim. You know. It wasn't a headshot, but it was still a no scope. Spray and pray. <laughs> What's that story? The guy, the soldier, has a bullet with his name inscribed in it in his pocket. That way he has the bullet with his name on it, so he never gets shot with it. Holy crap. You know. That's crazy. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa. 
This good pistol. This is actually good damage. That's oh, wonderful. Whoa. What hit me? I'm hiding. I'm coming. Oh, I'm about to die. Oh, I'm this safe. is bad. Uh oh. Maybe they'll jump on you and we can kill them. Yes. Come to me, friend. Switch into rocket launcher. Don't let me down, rocket launcher. No, no. Don't ascend. Oh, no. I got let down. Um, oh, I got him. Hoo, hoo, hoo. Okay, I'm coming. Oh, nope. Ah! It's too late. You tried. I tried so hard. But I couldn't get away. You tried so hard and you got so far. Yep. It didn't even matter. It didn't. It was all didn't for not. I can't even. I'm trying because to think of what eat. I want to eat. I just got a I'm pressure like... cooker. I need to figure out what sorts of things to eat. Ooh. I, ooh, I have rice cooker. I will make. Yes. So many times I just like find myself just eating steamed rice with a little bit of soy sauce. Mmm. I've been trying to cut back on rice this week because I had rice like four or five dinners last week. I think I ate like rice, like half of my food intake. I'm a fat kid. I just <laughs> like to put food in me. It didn't matter what it is. No, like it does matter. Rice. I just like making chicken and rice. It's like plain old, maybe some salt. Mmm. But my, my, my big problem is. I infrequently start preparing food until I'm dying of hunger. Right, I do the same. So it's like, I just want something to make quick. But when I do take the time to prepare food ahead of time, it turns out well. Hopefully the pressure we, cooker will help though. We recently switched over to parboiled rice instead of uh, brown rice. I don't rice, know what the difference is. So you know parboiled rice, rice it, they just, it's just cooked a little, it's like a boiled for a bit. I don't know. When it's, when it's, after it's been picked. Or after it's been harvested. Does that and mean it's it also... cooks faster, or what's the difference? So it's, it's still it, brown. It's uh no, it's it's like it's like white rice, but it is it's got so when it's been picked and it's been boiled in the shell, it keeps retains more of its nutrients and its vitamins and stuff. I see. It tastes better. Does it really? Okay. It, it's very good. Uh, it's a much fatter grain of rice as well, so it's a little bit okay. more hearty, a little bit more satisfying. But it tastes very, very good. In comparison to just plain white rice and plain brown rice. Mm -hmm. And um, it's a little bit better for you in terms of it's way better for you than white rice is. And it's a little bit better than brown arsenic. rice. Yeah. So it's good. And that's what we've been eating. And for a long time, we were just eating brown rice. And there's nothing wrong with it. I mean, it takes a little longer to cook. But other than that, it's fine. And but this one is much better. And it tastes good. It makes me feel like I'm a little bit more normal. <laughs> I don't eat as healthy. Because for the most part, we don't eat much of anything. We don't use a lot of oil when we cook. We don't eat a lot of greasy stuff. We don't mm -hmm. eat a lot of fried stuff. And we don't eat meat. So <laughs> that's like, what do we eat? Yeah. Uh, Oh no, they shot me out of the turret. No, come back. Oh, there was no timer on that one. Oh, you... I guess you died a couple times. It was times just my time. It was time to go. My poor heart couldn't take it. Why would these alien beings use grenades? Ha. When they have, like, all of this stuff at their disposal. They got those little staffs, they hit the grenades around. I think we're just playing Jaila. Probably. <laughs> huh. I think these continuously spawn. Oh, great. So we this music reminds shield. me of the nightclub in the Matrix 2. I haven't seen any of the Matrix movies in such a long time. <laughs> or the Matrix right, 1, I don't remember. There's a quest over here, do we want it? Uh, yeah, why not? It's stupid. Might we as need well. the experience, don't we? Give me. Talk to me. Talk to me. Sniper rifle. Cool, whatever. Let's just do it. Find the messenger. Oh, crap. You're dead. Nah, I'm fine. Cool. Things. Anything that takes more than a clip to kill is not my cup of tea. Unless it's a boss, then it's fine, obviously. Oh, yeah. Oh, the shield comes back way too fast. God dang it. Okay, I'm gonna shoot the shield and I'm gonna just run. Alright. 
We'll be safe on the other side. Yeah, we go. Here we go. Wee! Oh, did it. Oh, one of them came through. I feel like in Borderlands 1, maybe 2 to a lesser extent, um, you had to pay attention to like your damage types a lot more. Like, I need an yeah. acid gun for armor, I need a fire gun for flesh, I need an electric gun for lightning, etc. Especially once you um, you got into like true Vault Hunter and Ultimate because you yeah. needed slag for everything. Oh, Otherwise yeah. you would do no damage. Yeah, here they're a little bit more lenient. I think um, acid is like the new slag. Like it, it you could do more with Hurts it. Hurts everything. Or I'm sorry, ice is like the new slag. Oh, the shield didn't come back. God dang it. You smashed a skull. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's like the most I've ever seen. I've never bothered to look for them. I'm pretty sure that thing I saw in the spawn was one. Maybe not. I got elementalist achievement. That's a steam achievement, not a freaking Borderlands achievement. <laughs> I, don't, I don't see those very often. Had an enemy frozen, corroded, ignited, and electrocuted at the same time. Haha. <laughs> oh, beautiful. I don't even know how I electrocuted them. It must have been you. Probably, yeah. Because my, um... Your shield, Nova? Yeah, my shield would do both fire and lightning. Hmm. Which is okay. incredibly that, useful, because the more stacks of fire and lightning I have, the more damage I do and the faster I do it. Oh, that is cool. Oh, yeah. And there's a chance for me to use less ammo. Like every Useful. fourth shot or something. That's a cool looking effect. I always love, like anything, I always love like entering an atmosphere type scenes. Oh yeah, that's so cool. Space is awesome! Oh, space. I love space. Oh, it's terrifying, but I love it. Oh, I remember this place. We're probably going to finish the main game today, aren't we? Probably. Oh yeah. Depending on how bitchy the Sentinel feels today. Oh, man, I'm psyched about this. Can you see it? That's where At least it's not like right troll amorphous. <laughs> Fuck terramorphous. <laughs> Fuck that fight. I never bullshit. Right, <laughs> it is bullshit. It's I don't think terrible. I beat any of the raid bosses. Each of the DLCs had one raid boss, didn't they? Usually, yeah. yeah I didn't beat any of them. That none of them are as bad as terramorphous. Terramorphous oh, okay. is the worst. He will just well. I'm, I'm, I, I can already feel the descent. Is Terramorphous the um, crawler tentacle one, or is he the uber varkid one? No, he's the he's a tentacled one. Okay. He, he's a threat. He's a thresher. Yeah, he's a thresher. Thresher, that's the word. He. Where did I get? Oh, I thought I had gotten a. Oh, it is a legendary. Where the fuck did I get that from? Okay, I'll take it. We didn't help that crazy claptrap. Oh, yeah. He uh, can find enlightenment on his own time. We'll come back for him. What is that? That was cool. A smoldering wraith. How do you like bullets, smoldering wraith? Oh, you like my bolts okay, because I have fire bullets, so you don't really care. Yeah, he's like, whatevs. How about some frost, scarecrow? Now also burn. God, these guys are tough. You're dead. Maybe did. But stomp. Oh yeah. The stomps. You just been that's, butt slapped. That's my bread and butter is them stomps. <laughs> oh yeah, it's these flying guys are also fun. Stop it, you principal. Did you hear about that school? It was like in another country, but they like... They like cancelled school for a day because there was like an epidemic of possession. No. Yes. That's totally. pretty serious. Uh, they were just like, oh, you know... It was like everybody felt like they were being possessed. The funny thing was is that... We call that senioritis where I'm from. One of the, one of the, um, 
one of the reporters that were reporting on it was kind of like, are you sure you weren't playing a prank on the teachers? <laughs> yeah. And the kids kind of laughed it off. But then they proceeded <laughs> to like social stalk this. Per oh, I fell. No, I didn't. Social, social stalk the reporter. Uh-huh. And like make her life a living hell over it. Huh. Because she asked that question. I'm like, I'm beginning to think that that's exactly what happened. Yeah. If, if you're really against questions, it's a good sign people should keep asking those questions. Yeah. Or the answers are really important. Oh, man. For some reason, that reminded me, there's a... I don't remember where in the country this is, but there's like a, a train track crossing, and it's heard there's a, you know, there's a phantom train, like on a, on a night just like tonight, you can hear the train coming, and you can feel the wind of it passing, but you won't see it because it's a phantom train. Well, uh, oh, the trick is to hear it and see it, you have to have your car parked on the train crossing. And so, a couple of people died because it was an actual train coming, not a ghost train. What a dumb thing to do. Wow. Uh, yeah. We have a story similar to that in San Antonio. I'm sure you've heard of it. Everybody's heard of it. Mm. Um... So apparently the story goes, there was like a bus of kids and the bus like broke down on top of the train tracks and a train hit it and killed everybody. This is the and ghost part of the story or is it? Okay. So this is like the back part, like the, the leading up to it. So the way that you see the ghost or the way that it's supposed to happen is you park your car near the tracks, not on them, <laughs> and you sprinkle baby powder. Hmm. on the car and what you'll supposedly see oh and you also have your car in neutral okay. they're meant to push your car over oh. the tracks <laughs> and then when you get out of the car and look at it it'll have little handprints all over it oh how cute and they do that because they don't want you to get hit by the train supposedly that makes sense sure they're like so it's a sweet story but you know <laughs> I mean, it sucks. They're not pushing. But... They're not pushing fast enough. <laughs> yeah, it's like, oh, here comes the train. Ah, oh, jeez, Rick, the train's coming real fast. But you know what? There was this show called uh, Factor Faked Paranormal Files okay. or something on Sci-Fi, and they actually, I think they debunked that story in San Antonio because they they went to go do it, and what they found out was that although the land doesn't look it. It's actually ra it's actually downhill, even though it looks uphill because of oh, the tree lines. This very s oh, that's cool. And it's just a slight tilt too, like a super slight tilt. Yeah. So you won't notice it, and you won't travel very quickly, but you will travel over the tracks. No handprints, but that's good enough. Well, the handprints they say uh, the, their reasoning behind it was that you don't realize how much you touch your car dr throughout the day. <laughs> Sure. And you don't always see your handprints. So whenever you put the powder down, it'll stick to only certain parts of the handprints, you know, oil. Oh, and I all see that. what you mean. That kind of. I was thinking the powder wouldn't be where the handprints are, but it's the opposite. I see. Yeah. So it'll be, you know, it'll. Well, yeah, that or it'll displace it a certain way. Um, this reminds me. I played a game that I think you would like. It's a free game you can download. It's called Spell Razor. Um, there's a. I think it's a creepy pasta. Oh, what's it called? God dang it. Yeah, but I I'm remember a the wiener, name. dude. <laughs> it's a famous <laughs> it's a famous creepypasta about an arcade game that just appeared in arcades in the eighties. Jeez, that's weird looking. And um uh, So this arcade just appeared out of nowhere, all these arcades. And people would play this game and they were like addicted. They they like, had to keep playing this game. But they started like hallucinating and stuff, and then eventually like all the arcades of this game just disappeared overnight. So the, the idea behind the Spell Razor game is that it's the video game files from the lab that developed that arcade game. And so you have like people talking to you and you can like, um, it eventually, like, if it's like kind of like an augmented reality type thing. So like, eventually if you search some of the things you encounter in the game, it's like referring to, I can't remember the name now, but it's like the most haunted street in California, I guess, or in, in, in the country, Ooh. in the United States. Um, so I was reading the stories about that. There's some pretty cool stories. Because I guess oh. there's like an old Masonic Lodge or something. It's like this giant pyramid on that road. And it's abandoned and it looks really spooky. There's a lot of stories crop up about that thing. 
You gotta love how people are like, ooh, Masonic. It's a Masonic lot. Ooh. <laughs> it's like, yeah. guys, it's literally just like a club for guys. <laughs> like People with too much time on their hands nowadays. We have a friend who's who's in that lodge, like life, mm. and like Those we've like handshakes. we've like, yeah, we've like pe well that he won't show us of course. Of but, course, like, he'll, we'll pester him like, okay, so what do you really do? And he's like, we just we hang out, we eat a meal together, and we just, <laughs> just chill. It's like a it's like a club, but we just it's like a super secret club. It's Is not there even a, a big ramp deal. we missed. We gotta go around more. Yeah, I think we have to go this way once more. Um. I love it. That reminds me, I remember hearing a British haunted story. There's like this road, which is like the Hairy Hand of Kent, I think it's called. And oh, like, so I heard that. You're just driving and this this hand just comes along and tries to steer you off the road. Yeah. And so, there's like this guy, he's like, he got, you know, he, he crashed and the police officer was like, what happened? He's like, it was the Hairy Hand of Kent. It's like, well, what'd it look like? It looked invisible. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> like, um, <laughs> then how'd you know the hand was there doing anything at all? Do we jump or do we go back outside? I'm gonna jump and see where it takes me. I think maybe perhaps that that came he about because drunk. people are drunk or falling asleep. Yeah. Because whenever you wake up from being asleep, you tend to jerk a little bit, and like oh, that yeah, would definitely that. do it. Oof. You have you seen Rick and Morty? I have. I think one of my favorite episodes is the one where he, like, makes the devil try to kill himself. Oh yeah, dude, that was a great episode because it was just like, damn. Yeah, it's good. It's good in a lot of different ways. All those devil tropes plus it just shows Rick being a badass. I just I love yeah I love the whole fact that like I don't know there it's like go. he's like I am the devil. <laughs> So yeah, were you the devil or something? No, no uh, why would you say that? Oh man, I love that show. I need to go back and rewatch it all just because it's worth going back to see. There we go, Elder Ofa. I love the Ofa. I love their design. I actually do kind of like that weird face thing. Yeah, I like. I especially like the one that has like oh, all easy. the babies in it. That's one we just killed, isn't it? Yeah, I like that one. It's such a cool design, it just pulls There's babies a out. Dark Souls boss a bit like that. Have, have Aaron, have they fought, um, like the giant evil tree? I it's think an optional so. boss, so you can skip it. But it, like, at the second stage, like, this hand just comes out of it. It's like it's, it's, like, uterus gut area. Oh, no, maybe not. I need to go back and I need to go finish watching it. Maybe they have, and I just haven't seen it yet. It's, it's like the second boss, if you fight it when you first encounter it. Okay, I'll go back and look for it because I, I, that sounds interesting. The designs of the bosses in the Dark Souls series yeah. are really cool. Well, in Dark Blood Souls One, too. has my favorite has a thing called a Gape Dragon, which I'll let you look up on your own if you choose to. And there's Seath, or not Seath. Um, no, sorry, Seath the Scaleless is a different boss. Sith is what I'm thinking. Sith is a giant wolf who carries a giant sword in his mouth and does sick flips and twirls. <laughs> He's like oh, the coolest what's... thing I've ever seen. It's like Amaterasu from Okami. Yeah. Oh wow, that actually hurt. How about you don't hit me anymore, bub? Yeah, oh, he's very fixated on you. Why? Am I the apple of your eye? I love the design of the Sentinel. So cool. Yeah. I don't like his head though. I mean, like, how you unlock his head. Like, why would I ever want to wear that? Oh yeah. It's cool on him, but I mean... Oh, my head. He's like, what You're did you say about not wanting job. to wear my head? <laughs> That's not an insult. Oh, I can't get close to you. Holy crap, dude. There we go. Okay. Nice one. Good job. You, you just straight up, you nailed it. Get ready to jump. Oops. Yeah, I, I farmed I this, this boss quite a bit. Once he dropped oh. it, you were farming. Um, he, well, he's kind of like the, the, the warrior in that he'll drop random legendaries. Got it. Um, but I know he's known for a specific drop, but I can't remember what it is. It's been a long time since I've played. I'm sure I'll get corrected. His signature drop. God dang it, the hitbox in this rock is screwing me up. 
I'm running low on the H on the ammo. Oh there wow! Be little spigots. Spigots. Yeah, like they, you run over them and they pop out ammo. Oh, that's pretty cute. Well, here it is. You're fine, you're fine darling. You're fine. Just grand. Bitch. I flank and backstab. Oh, oh, he's- I pissed him off! He's mad! Oh, I've angered him! Snowball! Snowball! Uh-oh. Incoming! Hey, I jumped over it. I guess I wasn't tall enough. Yeah, there's on the like rocks a- rocks or something? There's like a- no, there's Oh, there's like the pustules window. you're talking about. Yeah. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Whoa, whoa, oh, whoa! Oh, no! I got you, though. I'm coming, I'm he knocked coming. me to safety, kinda. Ish. Ish. Relative. I got it. I got that guy. There you dead. go. Beautiful. Thank you. Freeze. God dang it, his shield's tough. Yeah, when he's spinning around, you can't really hurt him and he'll he'll knock bullets back, back at, at you. Back at you. Great. Yeah, what a dick. What a dickhead. Yeah, he's he's Whoa! Oh that could have been bad. Laser. Keep them occupied, Athena. Oh, I will. Oh, I forgot I have Provoke. Oh, That's God. Cool. I f no wonder he was so fixated on me. Ha. <laughs> oh, God. Big shafts of light. Big shafts. He's trying to shaft us. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Ouch. All right, all right. More dots. Got my shield out. Provoke. Stay ow, 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 her. ow. I think he deflected your bullets into me. Oh, I gotta run! I'm coming, I'm coming. Run, gotta run, gotta run, run, run. There's still enemies to kill. Oh no! Every time I go to raise you, he like hits me. There you go. <laughs> just out of range. Yeah, he's just like, no, don't do that. No. Stop it. Okay, it's shield's almost done for. Yeah. All my lightning will be useful at some point. <laughs> if you deplete his shield, it, it'll raise you back up, which is nice. Oh, I know. So I'm trying to pop him down. Oh, no, I guess not. It used to. Maybe that Where was is he? Oh, guys, he's in us. Ugh. Oh, I couldn't get high enough. Where are you? I see you. I was flying. Free like a bird now. This shaft. Oh time. no! Oh dear God. Oh nice. We're both self-sufficient, strong, independent women. Yeah. We don't need no man. <laughs> oh, purple shafts. Oh God! How'd that even hit me? Come here, you. I need to kill you. Yeah. You're my ticket back to the. Living. The land of the living. Yeah. Oh no! He's very wiggly. Stand and fight, you coward, you filthy cur. What a dick. Oh, I'm dead. I'm gone. No. What a, what no. a dick. No, I'm dead too. It's such a long run to get in too, so he may he may reset. I suspect so. But he has <sighs> stages, so I don't think... Do you think the stage resets, or...? It'll... It'll... Oh, you know what? That's a good question. Wish I, I think it starts from the beginning. Back. Great. I want to say that it does. I don't want to say that it does. I don't want to, but it's my oh, inkling right now. Wah. Yeah, this is this. It's. I didn't die on this boss when I fought him solo. <laughs> well, whatever. <laughs> Oh man, he's shooting me. I don't even have my gun yet. I'm just looking at my hands like, what are hands? I'm so hot. Yeah, right now. and he's like already Boom. hitting you. Like rockets! A dick. Rockets! Don't deflect the rockets, please. <laughs> Woo! Woo oh, ooh, his shield is going down a lot quicker, though. It's like I got my rockets on him, my lightning rockets. Oh, but I only have two oh. left. Get ready to jump! Crap. 
Oh, I did it. I got super high. Okay, I'm out of rockets. So now he's in a fire form, so my fire is useless. <laughs> but my lightning should Oh, he's hurt growling him. at me. That's scary. I have okay. snowballs. Let's see if he likes snowballs. I'm gonna hide yeah, back he, here. He makes scary noises. Did you... Uh, Nostalgia Critic has referenced this as one of the scariest moments of your childhood, and I completely agree. As a child, did you watch Darby O'Gill on The Curse of the Little People? No. Okay. I've seen it. I've seen it m now that I'm older, but I've, I didn't watch it when I was little. Oh, okay. But so you would probably agree that the banshees are terrifying as heck. Oh, dude, yes! Holy shit! I remember I'd literally like leave the room when I heard they were coming after the first time I saw the movie. I did not dodge dude. that because I was not looking. We're on his third stage. Yeah, he'll do it. Did he okay, just fucking lasers. He's a light. He's lightning stage now, so lightning does nothing to him. Oh no, that's ice. This is ice. Ah, so use all the fire. Oh, he's pissed. I've pissed him off. Oh, shafts of light. And a smash? Ranger? Big smash! Oh man! I, I was close. I almost did it. Oh god, I can't get near you. That's maybe fine. Come back and fight! Okay, thanks. Okay, now he's doing lightning. Just out of the sky. Yeah, and they'll do AoE. Great. So, you gotta be careful. Whoa! Uh -huh. Oh, frick. Damn shafts of light. I hate you, shaft of light. I You're hate not my real you. dad. Can't tell me what He's to dead. do, dad. He's dead. Loot, 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 I remember being like, yeah, and then being like, <laughs> oh, God. Oh, no. Yeah, I remember it being terrifying. What is this blue thing? Is that just oxygen? Yeah. Oh, is this purple thing? Purple oh, stuff. A, it was a clap trap last month. I like how blase, like, dramatic moments become after you play the game too much, like, there's this huge epic thing coming from the ground, like, oh, what's that? Oh, some money? Okay, it's just, uh, Yeah, sure. like, we're just completely ignoring him. He's like, don't ignore <laughs> Pretty much. Him. This reminds Experience. me of a boss yeah. from Oracle of, Zelda Oracle of Seasons, I think. Oh, I should have pulled my shield out later. This is gonna suck. Uh-oh. Oh, got it! Bitch! What do you do? So... What he'll do is he'll suck you in and then do a big yeah. chunk of damage, yeah? Yeah. So I'll pull out my shield about midway and soak up all the damage and then throw it back at him. That makes sense. Oh shit, he's pissed. I think there's one of these flying guys. The flying guys are the most impossible things to kill when you're dying. <sighs> yeah. Is there an advantage to being up here? I don't remember. I feel like you have uh, to do he's what you yeah, he's, he electrifies the ground. Ah. Alright, we got one form down. I think he's switching to... I need to kill nine more guardians to get an achievement. Oh, shit. Or a badass rank. I will try and come to you. Nope, it's not gonna oh, no, I'm dead. Yeah, yeah, that's... I forgot about that. Hey, I landed on a platform, though. That's pretty slick. That's pretty sweet. Anybody gonna fly over here so I can shoot? I bet you... No. Tough guy? The freaking you wanna fight flying... Me? Fight... Flying guardians Got never Got one of them. Oh, sweet, cool. I'll be back. I died. I'll be back. Stay alive, my friend. No, I don't know what to do. I 
I said stay alive. <laughs> I'm trying to do. I said stay alive! <laughs> Snubble okay, to the go. face, sucker. If I'm behind him, will this big smash hit me? No. No, it shouldn't. Here I can, I can hear him from the outside. He's like going, oh. <laughs> I have returned. Welcome back. Yay! I'm in the game. Uh -huh. So Athena has like a melee attack where she like flies towards the enemy. Yeah. In the beginning, that was like broken. She could do millions and millions of damage with it. So the right. way that I used the, the... to farm this guy is I would just go in and just fly at his face over and <laughs> over again. It was fun. Can you get dots on this guy? Doesn't seem like he can be affected by elemental damage. No, he doesn't have dots. But my, it's I still use them because it counts for my stacks, but they run they run out very quickly. I see. Like right now as we speak, I had a hunt like 200 and something and I'm down to 100. Oh, my least favorite form. I hate this one. Acid form. Yeah, because he throws up. That's gross. That's very gross. Ugh. You piece of shit. Ooh, 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 that hand almost hit me. He's very temperamental in this form. Black hole! I saw my life flash before my oh crap. I'm in a pit of puke. Oh no! Oh god, we gotta get I gotta get to it. Ugh. Okay, I'm high. Blew his face off. Beautiful. Even more beautiful. Oh, all the crits on the face. I should do the face more. Oh yeah. Once his mask is off. Yeah! Wow. Leveled up. Get the fuck out of here. Can't move. Okay, I stuck on his hand. Did you drop any loot? There's the loot. I yeah, I shall explode for. Oh, beautiful. Purple rocket launcher. I like a wonder burp. if they ever, if they ever fixed like the whole loot flying out of the field. Mm. Probably. One not. would hope so. But yes, who knows. Because I think I've saw I saw like videos like if you look them up online, there's like videos of like legendaries being tossed out, no! and they're like, no. <laughs> Ooh, a stingray skin. Ooh, sniper rifle. Is that better than my current sniper rifle? It is, and it freezes enemies solid. Beautiful. I'm full. Can I be full? Already have that stingray skin if you want it. Okay. Let me throw out some stuff because I have too much. Too much! It's too much, darling. Darling, simply just too much. Yes. <laughs> There's another sniper rifle. It's a poipo. Ooh. Ah, uh, it's not as good as the one I just picked up. I mean, oh. hmm, everything about it is better, except for the damage. Oh, yeah. Cryo grenade. Nah, nah, nah. I didn't find anything. But I got skins, though, and that makes me more happy. I like skins options. Are cool. Yeah. What's that blue thing? That's the cryo grenade? It is a cryo grenade. Okay. It is. All right, pick cool. up whatever for selling. For the but selling. Is, yep. We good? We good? Should I, did I pick up? I picked up stuff in the beginning without looking at it. I see if there's anything I think you might like. Do you like SMGs? I do. I love okay, SMGs. Okay, I will drop this purple SMG, but I think you might have already seen it. Oh, yeah. I'll take it anyway. Let's see. Let me do trash it. one of the white weapons that I have. Or one of those deals. Because I can get rid of... Yeah, let's do that. 
So I already have a shotgun. Lovely. It's lovely. What is this? Big bastard, wasn't he? Nicely done. Keep an eye out for that creepy red one. I don't want to get interrupted. Wait. What? That's it? That little thing. Athena's like, what's the big problem? <laughs> I'd forgotten what this was. Hey, a handsome. Oh. Yep. Couldn't see that coming, could you? She just teleports in and teleports out. <laughs> She just le yeah, she's like, I'm out. I like how, like, our characters are just kind of standing by watching this happen. Um... I'm gonna kill her. I'm gonna kill them all. Oh, first, you're gonna find me a doctor. So at this point in his life, does he have his daughter already? Mm hmm Oh, yeah. Face of Pandora. And then... And I'm assuming she's already been hooked up. She's been Probably. hooked up for a long time. Yeah, because she killed her mom on accident. Oh. We're going to scorch the freaking planet in fire. There's going to be screaming. Bandits are going to die left and right. <laughs> I can't wait. <laughs> Who was the big bad in the first one? In the very first Borderlands? Yeah. Um. <clears throat> the there wasn't really one, was there? It was kind of just open the vault first. Yeah, once you open the vault, and then it was the uh, whatever that thing was. That giant eye. Yes. Now do what you will. See, this is what I didn't like about Lilith. She's like, huh? Kill her anyway. You, if Brick is telling you not to kill someone, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. He was a bandit king for a while. Yeah, like, Brick will kill anybody just because it's fun. And for him to be like, don't kill her, she- because she was just a hired hand. She wasn't even in it, really. And Lilith was just like, no, kill her anyway. Now is not the time for victory, all touches. War is coming, and you will need all the vault touches you can get. Is this them foreshadowing their MMO? I'm thinking that's what it was meant to foreshadow, yeah. And then they were just like, eh, we're not doing Never it mind. after all. <laughs> yeah. But mm. like, yeah, that's that's one thing that I, di I didn't feel was in character with Lilith. I didn't think Lilith would actually try to kill someone after they were like, well, I had nothing really to do with it. You know? Like, it just yeah. didn't seem right. And I that's when I stopped liking her as a character. <laughs> I still like her look, but... Oh yeah, her aesthetic is good. I always liked, um, the new Siren more. Oh, Maya? Yeah, Maya's awesome! Her ability is also just more fun for me. Yeah, oh, dude, lift, lifting them, sucking everything in around them, so doing all good. the elemental damage. Oh, she's so fun. Mm-hmm. Yes. She's way better. Sorry, sorry, little fans. Which is <laughs> <laughs> Maya all the way. Uh, and this is the part where uh, YouTube copyright gets to go haywire. You could just, uh, you could just, you know, mute it. Put, put Unfortunately, song. I'm, I'm recording it in such a way that if I mute it, it'll mute you. Oh no! It's not a big deal. I don't monetize my videos anyway. I just don't like ads. Oh, I feel you. We'll have to. What are you? We'll have to talk. I'll have to teach you how to use uh, how to split your audio. So no, no, I can. I mean, if I use, if I was, I could use virtual audio cable, if I wanted. If I, but it takes work. I don't know. It's not hard. It really isn't. 
If I can, I've taught a few people, and some of those people. No, I've got it I working. I'm, when I do co-commentary stuff with people, I do it because I like to do the run post-processing on all the audios. Oh, I but feel um, that. I don't know. I didn't really care enough to do it for this. You're being lazy. It's fine. I'm not being, special. I was being lazy. <laughs> it's fine. I'm not special. It's okay. I understand. Your audio just sounds good as it is. That's what a lot of people have told me. They're like, "You have good audio." I'm like, "I have a, I have just a regular. It's a." Compressor, whatever they're called, mic. It's not a big deal. Same. I don't. Uh, I'm trying to think. Uh, so I, I run a fair amount of post processing on my audio, and I think it, I, I definitely like it because it, at the very least, having the compressor to make the loud, the quiet things louder and everything more even is nice. Mm -hmm. But I get, I feel like it adds bass to my voice, which I don't try to do. <laughs> but if it does, I think it helps. <laughs> it it helps to have a little boom in there. A little boom. It's useful. It sounds nice, especially for someone like me who, like, in my head, I sound like I have a deep voice, but in recordings, mm. I know that I don't have a deep voice. My voice definitely fluctuates kind of significantly between, like, sometimes, so in general, I, I like to record after eating, having a lot of energy, or not being hungry, but sometimes I'll record right when I wake up, because my morning, I like the way my morning voice sounds sometimes. <laughs> Oh, if you're gonna do like a calm, like relaxed playthrough, that's ideal. Yeah, just do a, 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 yeah, a lot of reading type of playthrough. Mm. Um, I guess I'm gonna stop recording here. Let me check if I have the DLC, but I think let's let's do that on, a, on, a, on whatever whenever our next session happens to be. Dude, yeah, totally. Mm.